Time for Mr. Truck, reviewing the latest innovations for your truck and trailer. Mr. Truck here. Yes, outside in the rain. It never does help us the weather. It's always a, a problem. But anyway, I'm here at Trans West and we've got our trailer back, our new trailer. You know, Andre and I picked out this four horse Cimarron a few months ago and we got one in. And Andre was using it for TFL Truck and I'm using it for MrTruck.com, sharing the trailer. And it's a great trailer. It's a four horse. It's kind of an unusual bumper pull. Usually the three horse or two horse. We got the big one. And this one's a little special. They built, they sold one that we were using, so they got us another one in right quick. Cimarron put the, the power to it so they could speed us up. And now we have it here, and it's a four horse. And we're going to be adding weight distributing hitch to it. But right now, I just want to introduce it to you because they've done a few new things to this Cimarron North Star. But this Cimarron four horse aluminum trailer, it's got four slant load uh, stalls and it's got a special new one for the stud stall. We'll show you all that and it's got something special back by the rear door. I'm going to show you all that. So come join us for the review of this trailer. Then we're going to be starting to load it up and take it on the mountains and do a bunch of other things but this is the first time I've seen the trailer and I wanted to show it to you. It is so cool. So here we are with our new trailer, this four horse Cimarron, four horse slant and it's got the drop down doors on this side and the escape door you know, a Trans West truck trader RV, they always equip these right. And you got the nitrogen in the tire, you got aluminum wheels, you got all the things you want. And this has got the drop down doors. I guess we call them feed doors, but you can put your feed bags in there, your water buckets, and your horse is safe and protected, and you can drop down that gate there, the guard. And the escape door has its own drop down window, but let's go inside and see what's cool. A lot of room in a stud wall, you know, protects the stud from the front so he doesn't get kicked or kicked the mares if you're hauling both of them in there. But look at that big wall. Now this, what Cimarron has learned, I'm sure Transwest was involved with Andrew, is this front stall. You know, when you don't haul horses up here, it's used to haul everything else you own, including your hay. So this, now instead of being a slant on this divider, it actually goes all the way up to the ceiling. So you've got enough room to really stack stuff in here, not have it fall in on the horses. Really nice new stud wall from Cimarron. And yes, Virginia, it is a North Star. Beautiful aluminum traders. Oh, look at this. It's the world's fastest trailer. It's got a spoiler like their RV traders or toy haulers. They're freedom traders. They put this on for us. It's got a spoiler, so we look cool. We're ready to go to NASCAR. Hang out. It looks like they've changed. It looks like they've changed the door latches a little bit. These are what you see on semis. Morgan was busy today, so I couldn't get her to show me this trailer. We'll have her do it next time. Look in here. We've got fiberglass roof. It's got a great insulating factor, and you can walk on it and resist hail. And I look across the stalls, three stalls, and there's that stud wall with that new divider. The new divider goes up and latches at the top as well as at the bottom like they always do, but this also latches at the top. So now you haul all kinds of crap in the front stall. I mean, you haul all kinds of hay and everything else that doesn't fit in your tack room. But this is so cool. Let's see what this is. I'm not even sure what that is. I will have to ask somebody because I'm not sure. Almost looks like a bucket holder, but I don't know. We'll find out. It's only in this last stall. So this is made to put maybe a divider in here for tack. But this back stall, of course, is much bigger. You could actually put, like a box stall, you could put a mare and a colt back here. A lot of room in the back end of this. Now on the tail side, it's got bus windows. They slide open, give you ventilation, they have bars in them. Then up here is the tack room. Oh yeah. It's got four saddle racks, 
and a couple blanket bars. And over here, you got your bridle hooks. And they've used carpets so those bridles and all that doesn't bang on the wall and make a lot of noise and upset the horses. And of course, there's your spare tire out of the sun and nice and dry and not muddy so you can get to it. All this stuff's hooked to a strut. A really nice equipped trailer. Yes, indeed. These are beautiful trailers. Stainless steel nose. They just look awesome. Even in the rain, they look good. So you're gonna see this trailer a lot. We'll all be using it. Andre will be using it. I'll be using it. And you'll see it on both of our channels. And it's a beautiful trailer. Brought to you by Transwest Truck Trailer RV and Cimarron Trailers. Now, all these heavy duty tires, these axles are 6,000 pound axles, so that's 12,000 GVW. So that's 12,000 plus 15% for the tongue. So you can go over 12 with that. Eight bolt wheels. You can see this in the rain, but that's what they are 6,000 6, uh, pound axles, 80 PSI. That means these are 10 ply tires. There's your sticker tells you all about the axles and the tires and ratings.